Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna be showing you today how to make an industrial pipe shelf. Um, this is just the way I made it. Um, there's various ways to make it. There's optional different types of pipe that you can use to kind of make the style a little bit different. Um, this is just what I chose specifically, but if you guys wanna see how I did it, just keep watching. The first thing I did was I removed my old bathroom decor and measured to see what length my boards needed to be. I ended up deciding on 18 inches. Once I measured, I was able to go outside and start on my cuts. I'm using a 2x6 board that was left over from a previous project that we had bought from Home Depot. Um, I do know that if you don't have a saw, Home Depot does make simple cuts, so that's an option for you as well. I wanted to show you guys the difference from the right to the left, or left to right, doesn't matter. Um, the one on the left isn't sanded and the one on the right is, and you can tell a big difference on how much not only smoother, but the color difference. So this is why it's so important to um, sand. I went ahead and I sanded both of them down using 80 grit sandpaper, and then after I was done with both boards, I went back and I sanded it with 440 grit sandpaper. I wanted to give my pipe a matte look, so I went ahead and spray painted them with some Rust-Oleum black matte paint. While I waited on my pipe to dry, I went ahead and started staining my wood. Um, I did do two coats of this stuff um, and waited about 15 to 20 minutes between. Just keep on fading in all these photos Caught in the memories and captured in the highlights Just keep on wasting Might be easier just to let it go Cut the cable short and the problem solved Might be easier I sealed my wood with some finishing wax, just applying it with a microfiber lint-free cloth. I assembled my pipe here just to show you guys what it's going to look like for whenever it's ready for my wood. I'm using a stud finder and marking where my studs are with a piece of tape. Um, after I do this, I then take my tape and actually cut out a strip that measures from one end to the other end in order to know where to place my holes or where to place my pipe onto my wood. Let it go, cut the cable short And the problem solved might be easier For you I do it all night You're my only night
second pair of hands in order to put the shelves on the wall. So I asked Josh to help me and we just placed them together. After we were done placing the shelves on the wall, all I did was decorate a little bit and there she was. So let me know what you guys think. I will have everything I used in my description below. Um, let me know in the comments below what you think of the piece and maybe what you'd like to see next. Thanks guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.